corazoncito está de luto por tu amor. Prende dos velitas y te escribe una canción. If you have good food, I mean, you don't have to be great or excellent, but then if you got have good food and good service, you know, it what will make the difference. Because you can have a restaurant with great food, but you don't have good service. It won't work out anyways. Um, and at that time, you know, is where I started learning more about the business and, um, you know, especially Tex-Mex food, even if I know some of the Mexican food, um, and then I learned a lot. And at that point is when I um, figured out that that was the business that I want to get into. I create our own meals, our own recipes. And when things start getting too easy, and I, 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 I want to add something else, you know, more challenges, <laughs> more challenges. For the restaurants, I've always worked at restaurants since I was 14 and able to, but I've always loved it. And he called me back to see if I would want to come work with him as manager. And he needed extra help at the restaurant and it was just perfect timing. I guess everything just happens for a reason. And and I don't know, God was watching over us and it was just perfect. It was, I moved down to Oatana, I moved back to Oatana and started with him. And he taught me so much, so much about the restaurant. Um, I just love the restaurant. I put all my passion into it and I just, it's where I like to be on my days off and at the restaurant. <laughs> So which one of you works hard? She does. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>